I'm just confused how quickly things went to shit. Like, this is day two. <laughs> Isn't this day two of the zombie apocalypse? Like, how did it, how did it go bad so quickly? <laughs> no, I don't get it. I don't even know if this is the next day yet or if it's still the first day. Uh, no, it is the second day. It is the second day. Uh, but it, it, it took like 30 minutes and the world was just like, boom. Okay, it's been a while. Okay, okay, okay. Got it. Thank you for explaining. I missed that. That, that, that's reassuring. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, I like Ken. We do. You said you wanted kids once. Uh, I did. Yeah. Well, she's not your daughter, so you can't treat her like she is. Yeah, I know that. But you can take care of her. Hell, maybe better than a father even could. Thanks, Kenny. I got your back, pal. No. Let me tap out just for a second. And there we go. Sorry about that. Uh, Doug, I saved your life, Doug. What do you have to say? I am your hero, right? I How saved you. Doing, you. Doug? We couldn't save her, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I... I know it's stupid. We just met. It's dumb. But, uh, I mean, it's, it's probably just that survivor thing. But I really liked her. Oh, she liked you too! She liked you too! She liked Sorry. you too. Thankfully. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it, buddy? How did you choose? I mean, we both needed you. You picked me. I was going to help you both. That makes sense, I guess. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish you would have picked her. Oh, <laughs> okay. Oh, I feel bad. I, I, I bet if we picked her, she would have been like, I wish you picked Doug. Okay, I can never make anyone happy. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> so ungrateful. <laughs> Oh, Grim Cuddy. I heard about that horror oh, movie okay. radar. Hey, Duck. Uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. It's just a walkie-talkie. It probably wasn't much use to begin with. It wasn't just a walkie-talkie. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Mm. Let me go deal with this. Oh, man, Clementine. Another Leave her alone. What do you want? You like my daughter? Yeah, she's great. Well, stay the fuck away from her. Or what? Or, uh, everyone will know that you, Lee Everett, are a killer. And you were before it was something you had to do to stay alive. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. You know who's really good at protecting people? Hey, Lee, Murderers. Do you have a second? Wait. My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That reporter is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. Oh, they're this gonna bomb Atlanta now, right? We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We 
could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Uh-oh. Oh, no! <laughs> Oh shit, we should have just continued like five minutes last time and we would have been done with the first episode. Crap. Okay, we I don't wanna see the next time on. Can I skip that? I thought we'd be fine if we survived the war. Although I have to watch it. Never expected it. I don't want out. I don't want spoilers. You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? Keep it. Hey, I owe you a lot more than a half eaten candy bar. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. No. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. Howdy. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you it's for saving Deacon. Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. Who the fuck is us? Now we're gonna take what we There's too many of them! I don't know who that is, but he died? What is happening with the music? There's so many spoilers. No more, please! No more, please! Please, please! That was so loud. I don't, that was what I was saying. I was like, why is it so loud? <laughs> Uh, but yeah, Radar, I saw that Grim Cussy movie. I saw someone talking about it on Reddit. Basically, it was like, um, uh, you infer- Wait a second! Only 30% of players choose to save a child over freaking Sean? Why? Okay. I'm gonna need you to yell which choices you think I should pick. If you want to. You don't have to. But if you want to be part of this, you can you can yell. Oh wait, do I have to play? Oh, I have to play. Oh. Do you know this game is from like 2012? Damn it. What'd they get this time? That guy uh, dies. Looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, so I that's preview. another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. Last night, I heard your friend Doug laying in bed just naming types of pie. It's driving me nuts. <laughs> Doug he's is me. To lose it. He's not the only one. Won't you cut him some slack? Yeah, why yeah. are the people in anime yeah. with glasses I always evil? I wish I knew evil. for sure how much food we have left. You'll have to ask Lily. She's the one handling the rations. Or mishandling it, if you ask Kenny. He's just worried about his kid getting it now. I worry about Clementine, too. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. He's got a wife and son to look out for. And they're safest in a big group. Going out on his own will get them all killed. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. He's just rude. Hey, Toadie. <gasps> Crow. Uh. Larry's just uh, looking out for his daughter. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take that you energy know Lily? towards finding this us some when? food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker. But the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? 
knock me flat. Yeah, Lee's voice is very nice. Kill the crew. No, don't, don't. No, 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 don't. Don't do it. Don't do don't. it. Don't. Gun shadow bring walkers. One bird's not worth it. <sighs> yeah, I know. I'm just really freaking hungry. And it's also a nice bird. Ah! Food. Shit, was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. Teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These I have might an be axe. the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? I don't know, man. Who raided your camp? I, I don't know, guys with guns. Please, we won't bother you, I swear. Lee, this is fucked up, we've gotta help him. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Was he bitten? Bitten? No, I swear. <laughs> hurry, please, hurry. There's zombies around. Please. What do you think, Chad? What do we There's do? No release latch. I'm gonna chop the leg off. Oh no. I'm gonna chop the leg off. Easy decision. Walkers. No, uh, me, his leg please. is probably not that broken. Get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of I me. I can, I can, I can open it. How the fuck do you get these things open? We it. don't know. <laughs> it's impossible. It locks or something. Hurry, please. Get me out of this. Do you think you can get it open? Just uh, pull on it. Stop, stop, stop! <laughs> this can't be happening. Hurry! Uh, this is bad. Let's go, this let's so go! Bad. Did it work? There's gotta be something we can do! Come on! Try something! Oh, Jesus! Uh, things are gonna be here soon! Forget it! We used to like that at the Air Force Base with the Dordans. Please You're hurry! Not not okay, okay, Air Force me. Base, blah, blah, blah. Uh, a stick. Maybe I can pry it open Please. with this branch. You can't just leave him like this. I want my leg. I want my leg. Damn it, leave this is so out. stressful. Ah, God, God damn it! I'm sorry, but we have to go Jesus, now. Oh, I God. need to walk. Please save him. Oh, no, no, no! Stop, oh, man! Oh man! Fuck! Fuck! I'm just wasting ammo now. Why would we gotta somebody go? do this? Oh God, there's so many of them. Damn it! This is bad. Really bad. Okay. okay, 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 I'll have to, uh... We're gonna be surrounded any okay, please, I'll, I'll do please. it, whatever, sure, do it, you just don't tell him, don't say anything, just do it, no, no warning. No, 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 try the trap again, anything, please. Okay, I'll try the trap again. Come on, get okay, okay. it off! I, uh, if you say I, I should try the trap again. Maybe we can smash it. Smash it, yes. Oh, God, hurry. Okay, okay, no. Come on, we gotta go, now! Wait. No. <laughs> no, don't leave me. No. Damn it, Lee. No, I'm sorry. No, I was too indecisive. No. I should have no. taken the leg. We can't leave Mr. Parker like that. Give me the gun. Uh, uh, give it to God me. Damn it, let's Travis. Go. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> what did I do? No. Shit. What happened? Oh no! <laughs> this is awful! Oh, Grab the kid and keep moving! Is he dead? I'm so sorry. Hey Mad Grab. Welcome. Oh, leave me like this. Please get me out. But chop him in the head, maybe. Do shoot him in the face. Oh no.
We could have eaten him. Sorry. This literally couldn't have gone worse, I agree. We could have had him as food, at least. When are we gonna go cannibal? This scared me. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! My God. I really what like Walking Dead as a TV series, though. Don't have time to explain. Wait, Shit. Are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll These see what are I our dinner. Can, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Wait. I, I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you um, want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. We're the ones that shot him. Then you should have done the right thing and finished them off. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you? Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine. You guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. But, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. <laughs> hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Kenny. Nazi. Kenny's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Yeah. Really? You weren't there. Lee made a choice. End of story. Look, once Katja patches that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the walkers. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd realize that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. <laughs> She's like, Dad, yeah, Dad. Why don't you go help Mark <laughs> with the wall? Yeah, you Dad, know you know if I you do. think I'm doing I such a ball. shitty job, then you do it. That's all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. Lim. No, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to not have enough food for everyone. I'm gonna eat it myself. <laughs> you only have four food items for 10 hungry people. You know what? Can I eat it myself and just blame her? She did this. I didn't. Just hum, hum, hum. <laughs> quickly. Uh, can I? No, you know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make. This is kind of an easy decision. I'll just give the food to the kids. Is he gonna be okay? If my kid gets know. two. Can you give me a hand, real quick? Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this. Sewing up people's injuries. What were you thinking bringing him here? Even if he lives, we aren't going to be able to take care of him. I 
I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. The right thing is just scary sometimes, I guess. I like Tatya. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Tatya is nice. I think. Mm. Doug? Doug gets no food. Hey, Doug. <clears throat> ah. What's up, Lee? Think Katja can save that guy? Maybe. I mean, I know about computers, but that doesn't mean I can fix a calculator. But you probably could fix a calculator. Well, yeah. Good point. What are you working on, Doug? I've worked up a little warning system for outside. How does it work? I set up trip lines at four locations, and each one triggers one of these four bells. So... So we'll know where they are and how long we have. Smart. No Take food easy, for Doug. Doug. You too, Lee. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Oh, she's so cute. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Give her food. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Mm, I feel like she wants the crackers and cheese. Crackers and cheese. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. If you have any more food, Duck is hungry too. Oh. Yeah, why don't we then get some food? Okay, Duck gets some food because he's. Hey, Duck. How he's about duck. a little food? Oh, uh, Duck also get everyone gets crackers and cheese. Here. Yeah. Oh man, I'm so hungry. Want something to eat? He gets an apple. Here, Ben. After what you've been through, seems like you could use a pick-me-up. Oh. Seriously? I know food's scarce. This is really... I really appreciate it, man. I'm keeping it. Keep my too. <laughs> That's my food. I did it. It was easy. Not such an easy job, is it? I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee. Kenny, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice. But you took care of the kids. That's what a real man does. Thanks, Kenny. Still... I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. Yeah, I You're chose to out. give it to the new kid. What happened to my food? There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. I, I wanted to give it to this kid because... I killed his teacher and his friend, so I felt like he deserved something. Hey, is my friend gonna make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe we just left Mr. Parker there. I tried. I really did. I just ran out of time. There was nothing else we could do. So who are you people? Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The guy in the truck is Travis. He played in the school band with me. Mr. Parker was the band director, but... No. <laughs> God, I can't believe we left him. How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, um... Uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of... I don't know. Something. 
I don't know either. It's killing me. Relax. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. Oh, I feel really bad. I'm so sorry. I, I really messed up, okay? I thought I would have more time. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. I want to go to a boat. The coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. I'm just picking decisions with no thought of the consequences. What am I doing? Oh well. I go. This place is boring. And there's no food here. I feel like go going somewhere else is smart. Lily, I. Uh... I see how it is, Lee. Talk to you later, okay? <laughs> oh no, she's pissed I didn't give any food to her. Uh... We should talk about you and Kenny. What about us? The arguing. It's getting pretty out of hand. You know people notice that. Look, I'm working my ass hey, off to make sure Valentine. we Ooh, that's a long time. Just doesn't appreciate that. All we need is food. But there is no food. You know that better than anyone. Well, we'll just have to find some. And they are in Georgia. Maybe we should think about leaving the motel. God, not you too. The, the I know state. Kenny wants to leave. I think that's why he's so eager to get the RV working. But this is a good spot. We're protected, we're close to the drugstore, we have a routine now and it's working. For now, keep an eye out. Fine. Have you changed your name, Simply Valentine? I don't really recognize your name. Maybe you've changed it, and that's why. Uh, I want to look for her hat. Sturdy, but it's not gonna hold up forever, just like the rest of this place. We should go to the coast. You know what's on the coast? Fish. Unlimited. We dug through those for food a long time ago. And crap. Crabs, not crap. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Can we just leave him behind? He sucks. Hey, will the kid make it? I don't know. You know it was an accident, right? I didn't mean to shoot him. I know. It was crazy back there. Kid acted stupid. Sorry, there's, there just wasn't enough food to go around. I understand. Got to be hard to make those decisions. Just get me next time. You ever miss the Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely a Zombie overrun. fish bites you? Do you turn into a zombie or a fish? Both. Lily's pretty pissed at us. Well, what Zombie did she mermaid. want us to do? Just leave a couple of teenagers to the walkers? That's exactly what you should have done. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. I'm definitely not giving it to Larry. Fudge you, Larry. You get nothing. Here, Mark. This should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? You suck. Come on, Larry. Cut Lee some slack. He knows you're just out to protect Lily. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clementine. He... Oh, I just need some food. Going this long without a proper meal make anybody cranky. Ken, Lee, come here, please. Oh, no, did he die? He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. Oh. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Look, I have Ken, a... Come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Kaja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried. But he was never going to survive. 
Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? Oh, he's having... Oh, he's a zombie? He's a zombie already? Shit, I thought I had a solution to our food problem. What I do? 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 Move, move! Shit, it's stuck! I got him! And my food! Use the left stick? I don't have a stick! I'm on PC! I don't have a stick, I'm on PC! What do you mean? I don't know what that is! Okay, one more time! Okay, left stick has to be shift and back. Shift and S. Am I doing it? I did it! Oh no! Oh no! Yeah, crap! Push his eyes! His eyes! Push it off! I don't wanna hit you! Oh! No! What did I do? Okay, again. This is hard. I got him! Go away, zombie! Hey, Ammo Greed! Oh. Hey, Ammo Greed, how you doing? Okay, go away. Back, 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 back. Yes. Okay, I can do this. Push it off! I don't want to hit you! Yes! Damn, I was gonna suggest we had a solution to our food Thanks. problem, but I didn't think he was gonna turn so quickly. No problem. We gotta watch each other's backs, right? Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! You said he wasn't bitten! What? We asked you point blank, was he bitten, and you said no! Oh, they don't know! Well, you're not oh, you don't here. know! Came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. We're all infected? Everyone? I... I guess so. I don't know, I... All I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. I just want to say thank you for saying that I'm agreed. We're doing really bad here. <laughs> I'm making Duh. horrible choices. It works. But I'm trying my best, okay? Of course it works. I'm glad you're doing very well. Shit, where'd this string come from? Watch where you're walking, man. <gasps> Who are those people? I don't know. Are they the people that raided your camp? I don't think so. But they all had their faces covered, so I don't know. There's just two of them. We need to make a stand. No, we have a routine. We don't confront them if we don't have to. Can we All be right. friends? Yeah, just getting untangled. I don't know how you're still alive, man. Sorry, Lily. We gotta do this. That's far enough. Oh, shit. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, no problem. You're outnumbered here. Just turn around and go back. Okay, that's fine. Uh, but, but you'd really be helping out a fellow survivor if, if you could part with some extra gas before we leave. What do you need gas for? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. 
Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If, if y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. Ooh. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. Yeah. I'll go too. Improve the numbers in case we run into anything dead. Yeah, so, let's bring uh, Doug. What do y'all think? He's smart. Okay, yes. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So this is a good choice. Dairy. This is a good, this really is a smart food? choice. Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still yeah, have lots of Yeah, this game is milk, really stewing after the outbreak. Up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. Veg. Thanks for coming along, Doug. Sure. I'd like to get a look at that electric fence they talked about. It might give me some ideas for something I can rig up at the motor end. Can an electric fence really stop walkers? Well, as long as the walkers aren't completely dehydrated and the fence has enough juice, yeah, it seems plausible. The electricity basically cooks you from the inside out, right? I guess so. So, if a walker stays in contact with the fence, it'll eventually cook its brain. It probably takes a while, though. And that can't be a good smell. Unless it smells like jerky. Man, I could go for some jerky. <laughs> What's that you got there? Oh, nothing. It's just a laser pointer I picked up during our last trip to the drugstore. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? The motor end's my home now, I guess. Hmm. Well, that place seen better days, huh? We've actually made it pretty secure. I like that alarm system you made. That's pretty smart. Don't tell them about that. You don't tell them about that. settled in at that motor end. Uh, who's running things over there? I mean, it is, it is Lily. It's Lily. Lily. She runs a pretty tight ship. Her and her dad are ex-military. Yeah, she knows her shit, but she needs to know when to back off sometimes. How many people you got over there anyway? Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Do we do well, I trust them? We'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and they seem quite nice. frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's. Getting... You think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No, not again. Not again. <laughs> no one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided my camp. Who are they? Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry, and you guys were keeping it all for yourself. What we do? Yeah, and you know what? We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? <laughs> Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens, but let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! Oh, whoa, oh, whoa. Oh. Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh, shit! Asshole. <laughs> the world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Didn't we loot the other guy? He has a crossbow. I could use that. Okay. He has too many questions? Yeah, maybe. Ooh, you want to own a farm? Then I know I'm going to call you if there's a zombie apocalypse. Or food. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. Oh, it's perfect. Look at the car. Y'all can see hey. how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. Oh, wow. Someone's gonna you die. You guys must know a thing or two about running wire. Had a guy who did, yeah. This is a really brilliant setup. Suits us just fine. Oh, wow. You've got enough electricity to run the whole place. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's been living down at the old motel, round the way. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. 
Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. Oh, yeah, uh, I thought she was asking about survival tech. Oh, no! Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're starved. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Holy moly! They're made from human milk. No, I'm kidding. Sorry, that was awful. <laughs> Scratch that. Sorry. They're not that 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 that. Can't get stuff like that uh, anymore. Someone wrote cannibals, milk, but that doesn't. <laughs> butter, that's for sure. That's right. It Hopefully doesn't make you a cannibal. We'll make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick. What she? We have a vet, but we could bring her here. We can help you folks out. Who's the vet? A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered. Maybe our whole group could come. Oh, gotcha. for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Do they look like cannibals? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip back here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. No problem. Ben can come with me. Ben? Take this. All right. See you later. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Uh, we should help them out. They will like They're that. They're offering us food. We should do whatever we can to make these people like us. The way Brenda was talking, I get the feeling like she'd be happy to have us stay. All the more reason for us not to fuck this up. If Andy needs some help securing the perimeter, then that's what we do. We be nice. Oh, hey, you, sir. That's so cool. This is my first time playing them, but I'm glad to hear uh, you love them or like them. I'm just going to talk to him first. So what's your read on Andy so far? Think they'd be open to letting us stay? Getting the perimeter secured is going to help us a lot. We'll be getting in good and making this place safer for us. I'm going to get smart. back to it. Smart, smart, smart. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. Mind if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. <laughs> fix their swing. That sure is going to show them. I am a reliable swing repair man. No, don't, no. Uh, how do I... Where did he go? He was supposed to help him, but he disappeared. Is he this way? Oh, hey, here. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old yeah, one everyone is so suspicious. Matt, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. 
We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. <laughs> these generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Like us. I just feel like this is not so smart because like eventually they are gonna run out of fuel. But barbed wire fence is still pretty good, I guess. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. Wait, Fences other people? In about Wait. Three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husk. Other out. people have stayed you at the farm? I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and What happened up to the them? Generators. Did they well, eat them? Great. I'll turn off the northwest section and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well that'd be a big help. I am willing to bet Pay attention. You never know. I'm willing to bet a cheeseburger that they're cannibals. I'm getting so cannibal oh. vibes. Cannibal vibes. Oh, I didn't fix the swing. No. I didn't fix the swing. Do you think we're doing enough to get the St. John's to like us? Well, we don't want to seem over anxious. Showing them we can handle this fence is going to go a long way. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. It wouldn't be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. I, They're I'm, not vampires. We're out in the sun, guys. Get it together. My gosh. I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. There's one. Ugh. Oh, Wait, I see a good sign. Come on, let's push it off. Wait a minute. What is this arrow doing here? Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Uh, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. The other people had arrows. Disgusting. Ugh. Ugh. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Uh, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Cannibals, 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 cannibal. We've got enough people to take this place by force if we have to. Sheesh, Lee. You sound like Kenny. There's another one. I see it. Amb ambivalence? Yeah, it means being unsure. Or like, yeah, not decided. Or like, well, you're like, <laughs> Oh, no. Man, the fence burned right into its hands. I think. I think Hesitant, yeah. Man, the fence oh, burned right sorry. into its hands. I think they fused together. Choppy, choppy. You never Gross. get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. I, I say we Can't take it by force. I've seen Would have been The Walking nice Dead TV show. Rations. I get hungry too, you know. They're gonna serve, they're gonna serve meat too. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. I think they smell like, zombies smell like Come rotten on. steaks. I think I, I see think. where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on. I'm just checking if he's dead. Lee? I don't trust that he's dead. Q, 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 Q. Okay, he's dead. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. 
Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. What the? Get to the gate. Get down. You asshole. Jesus. We had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With a fence on that gate, it's our only way out. Can't hide forever. Okay, we can move the truck. We can go with the truck. No? Get close there, you boy! Hello? I already got one of you. What about all arrangements? I got you now. They have an arrangement? Did you really think we you had fucked an with us? Now you're fucked! Oh, we need to move uh, the thingy. No fuel. Of course. Well, but can't you just? Do this all day. I see you. Can't you just push it? Why can't you push it? I don't get it. Something still blocking it. Ah, that thing. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. <laughs> they, I don't know what his name is, but he still has an arrow in the in the shoulder. Lots of free arrows. They have a lot of ammo. I got one of you. Over there. Blech. What happened? Oh, shit. You it's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. You know, I'm gonna have to move. I see him. Right. We have you a uh. Where do you think you're going? <laughs> and like that they're just we had a deal we had a deal it ain't right we had a deal another one <laughs> how many of those things they're did very push down? Um, they're very stuck on that deal did you really think you could fuck with us don't think i can't see you oh, oh no 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 oh oh oh, oh. Yeah. Gross. Come on. The gate's right oh, there. Oh no, he's behind. No, this is annoying. No. <laughs> Thank you. Let's get out of here. Thanks, Zach. I bet they can't aim that well. Oh, I think Lee is fine. <laughs> Lee, what's wrong? There was a goddamn ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? Bandits here? On our property? Oh the my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark. Oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh yeah. no, honey, come on, Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? <laughs> we ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it! Doug said this place was safe. So much for your deal. Those shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were gonna give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't okay. no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. 
What we I need to so do too. is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Doug? Since Doug ate half the biscuits on the way to get us, I had them stay back. I still don't think we should be trying to stay here, and someone's got to watch the motor in until we get back. Game turned into rust, yeah. <laughs> True. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. Oh. Hope your kids like swings. A swing! I love swings! Just like at my treehouse! Come on, Doc! Oh. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah! Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. All right, see you, Mr. Veggie Mommy. I'm not sure if you're trying to troll or if you're just like oversharing, but you know, yeah, maybe, maybe ch cool it down a bit. I think you're trying to be funny, which I appreciate, but <laughs> maybe, maybe cool it down a bit, okay? That thing keeps a fence electrified. Well, we knew that already. Thursday evenings are wild, yes. Uh, a lot going on. What do we have over here? Planks? Do I want the planks? We. What? Well, bet they go through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. If a couple of tools out in the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor end. Okay, I'm just gonna ban this person. What a troll. Yeah. Don't, don't. Just ignore. <laughs> I feel a lot of people, I think that's a fun thing about, I, I, I want to say boundaries, but I don't know if that's even boundaries. But usually if someone comes in and they're acting a little bit off, they're a little bit like, hmm, this is odd. Usually if you say something like, hey, can you cool it down a bit? Usually uh, people will either be like, oh, I'm sorry. And you know they're good people, or, or they will react like that, and then you know, oh, it's a troll. Uh, I guess I'll go over here. Hey, how uh, do I say Alejo? Alejo? Did I pronounce your name? Hi, how are you doing? Yeah, that's true, that's true, Snow. Dumb nicknames is usually a, or weird nicknames is usually. For all of us. I guess a few fine. of us could camp out here in ships. I was gonna say, the fact that Larry said, Oh, don't worry, these seem like nice people. Makes me feel like they Looks are like nice a people. Station for the cow. Because Larry's like the most unlikable, grumpy man ever. And he's like, no, they're nice. Then they have to be nice, right? I don't know. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Horn. Where am I from? I'm from Stockholm, Sweden. Oh, we already checked. Oh, can I go inside? If there's not enough room in the house And the for internet, us, yes. I guess a few of us could camp out here in ships. Oh, I thought he was gonna open it because it's a hand sign. Okay. I'll just look at it. Hey. Lots of hay. Hmm. Enough of these might work as adequate cover for Merrill's, if that becomes a problem. Hmm. Can can we eat hay? I feel like we probably cannot eat hay. Are you actually from Honduras? Ah, uh, that's probably not how you pronounce it. Oops. Can I talk to them? Oh wait, yeah, I should go talk to them before I do anything else. When I'm already here. It's good to talk to everyone. See what's up. Isn't hay just a different type of oatmeal? No! What? <laughs> no! <laughs> what? It's not oatmeal. Oatmeal Please. is porridge. Oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? I'll be fine. Hey, he's I've dressed. Seen guys go no? through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? 
I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make Did I see the series? Way. Yes. I tried seeing things Loved from his it. point of view, having a wife and kid and everything. But gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Lee, I know you and Kenny are friends, but you recognize that he's not the right person to lead this group, don't you? Oh, really? And I pronounced it well? Thank you. Oh, that's so cool. Oi, oi, oi. You're a good leader, Lily. Kenny's too emotional, but his intentions are in the right place. Still, it'd be best for all of us if you two could try to work together once in a while. Yeah. Can I talk to Larry? I cannot talk to Larry. Okay. Well, let's move on then. Mm -mm -mm. So no age, so it's Honduras. 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 I can't pronounce things. I'm Swedish. Wait, I didn't talk to Clem. Fellas. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. You no should have. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Not now. We'll go in a few minutes. Just need to check on a few things before we head out. Oh no, Sir, I didn't see I didn't Talk things over I didn't find group. Clem's Just hat. Come find us when you're ready. Oh, oh I'm messing so many things up. Her hat is gone. You're from Colombia, so you only understand a little bit. Don't worry about it. I don't speak... English is not my first language, so I only understand a little bit, too. So we can understand little together. Oh, no. I'm so sorry about your hat, Clem. Hey, Clem. Do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Sure. Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for well, a bit. Well, we didn't. Okay. We lost Clementine's hat, so there's only like one reasonable thing to do now: kill Kenny and give her his hat. How you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? Yeah, lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Yeah, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Yeah. Yeah. I'm not sure when. One day, things have got to get back to normal. That's good. I hope it's soon. Yeah, me too. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Of course. It's all yours. Yeah! Okay, Duck. Don't pop a gasket. I don't know if I like Doug. They look happy. Hey. Hey, Lee. How's it going with the St. John's? Did it ever Good. get to normal in the TV show? Not really yet. It's still ongoing. And it just gets more chaotic. Besides the fence. <laughs> we seem pretty appreciative. Great. Sounds like they're starting to accept us. Definitely. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? I guess, uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here? I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch them go hungry. You're with me on this, right? 
Eh. I'm not choosing. You're not making me pick sides, Kitty. Well, you better think about it, because that time is coming. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? Well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Uh, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. I hope you're right. Duck and Clementine deserve a better life than starving to death at some crappy motel. Mm. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. Sounds like they're pretty amped up about it. This might be a good way to earn their trust. Good idea. Yeah, they kind of gave up on finding a cure in the TV show. But to be honest, like, they have a lo lot of other troubles that needs more immediate attention, I guess. Okay, we'll go, we'll go scope, scope things out. Hey, Lee, change your mind about going out to track down them bandits? Yeah, let's go. Yeah, we gotta work together on this. Those bandits are a danger to everybody. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Kill everyone, got it. <laughs> are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. See anything? Not yet. I know it's around here. It's gotta be close. To be honest, I think yeah. they kept up the story in the TV series really well, oh, though. Shit. You found it. The prison part was a bit boring, but then when Negan comes in, very good. So if you go, go to the prison part and you're like, I don't know if we want to continue, just do it. It gets better, and then it gets worse again, but it's okay. <laughs> Where are they? Is it a trap? I think it's. I think it's a trap. You see anybody? Stay on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the ten. Camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. Oh, don't you think this is where the kids were place. hanging out? The kids and the teacher? Human food. Just water. No. Oh. But it's boiling, so they were just here. So it's not the kids and the teacher. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? This is too much stuff for just one person. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. Hmm. Hmm. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> it's just something, sus something suspicious. Nothing but fumes. Shit. There's gas here, though. Hmm. 
Tent looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid-sized. Kid-size. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Empty. Ooh. Why is that? Why is this so suspicious? Listen to it. What do you find? A video camera. That's Let an iPod, that. sir. Battery's dead, though. I think. Oh, I don't shit. know. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. You should watch I the video you camera. I handle that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, right. You did say she was running things for you. Sounds like you picked a good leader. How do I watch the video camera? I can't go into my in inventory, can I? I don't think I can. Nothing. Hmm. Yuck. I don't need that. <laughs> the facial animations are bad enough that I can't tell if this guy is sus or not. He's sus. You know it. Empty, but it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Okay, what do I need to do? I want to watch the video camera, but I can't. Okay, wait, what? There's been a kid here. Oh, where did he go? Oh, he's there. Oh, man. Kid's dead. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. <gasps> the hell? Don't you fucking move. Shit. Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you Cannibal, do. cannibal, you can sorry. Me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Look, it's not safe up here in the woods. You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a hell of a lot safer up here than down there, you best believe. Can now, maybe can you can didn't can hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice soft arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what happens, one of us is gonna kill you. Like you could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Killing everywhere. Take all the dead folks you want. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for- oh. Cannibal, cannibal, cannibal. God damn it! I was five seconds away from shooting her myself. <laughs> I Maybe was not, but uh, I think I think uh, I don't know. <laughs> I think it's a like, smart thing to say. I don't know. <laughs> it's a clean shot, though, right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So that's it. We going back? 
If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. There's little brains on the ground. Come on. Very sus. I think we gotta take this farm ourselves, you know. Maybe we can take it for ourselves. You said she had a little girl, didn't she? Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on Maria. Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. Don't eat their food. Don't eat their food. I haven't seen a cow, you this know. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. Oh, this is the best episode? Oh, really? What's going on with that? Thank you for saying it, Mr. Miss Enforcer. Mr. Twilight Enforcer. Looks like a lot of tension with y'all, huh? Uh, don't mind them. It's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. We all get a little testy. We'll fix that shortly. How shortly? And Lee? Don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. There's no cow. There's no cow. They're gonna eat the children because children are tastier. Okay. Maybe there is a cow. Okay, I'm gonna go over there. I want to watch the video, but maybe I need to watch it with Kenny. Kenny and I can watch the video. And the video is gonna have evidence of cannibalism. How do you know children are tasty? I don't know. I'm just guessing. Where's the cow? There's a cow! <gasps> there's a cow, there's a cow. Oh, it's a prize winning cow! Oh! It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay, go ahead. Pet her. Pet the cow. Oh, Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. <gasps> Go, baby. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. He licked it. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. How's the cow? How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. Um, when do you think uh we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. We're gonna Mama's be eating up. Mark! <laughs> Sorry. I'm not gonna tell him that. Or I can tell we him that. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Thanks. Yep. Suspicious. This is a human farm. Sorry. Okay. Where are the cows? Oh, hey. I want to play in the hay. <laughs> Just stay close to your mom. For Sorry. That. Okay. I want to 
No, we hey. don't come back. Just stay close to your mouth. <laughs> we thought something else was gonna happen. Okay. Okay, I can I can go back. I wanna play on the hay. Oh, what's here? Meat. Oh, what's in there? Uh, what? Oh, what's Empty. in there? There's no food. There's no food. Where's the food? Where do you get the food? Oh, <gasps> cannibals! Sorry. Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Lee. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Lee, think for one. Lee, use your tiny little brain for one second. They're gonna make children pie. They're gonna be making children pie, Lee. Think about it. It's a feeding trough. For human! Somehow. There's children, uh, there's humans in here. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Meat Don't grinder. Get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. So mean, Look, I could say, like, she's actually not my family. He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, kid. Then we kill them and take right, the farm Professor, and the food. In mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. No, I, I'm with Kenny. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban. <laughs> oh, that's you that's are um. Not saying what I think that's racist. Saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. This is, I mean, he's from Florida. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about you. Bandits are in the barn. Sorry. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, doc. They could also be her husband who's in there. Her husband who's a zombie. That, that feels pretty walking deady. Distract Andy to get him out of the door. Okay, the barn. I'm good at distracting. I'll say, hey, Andy, there's a person out there. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. You got a screwdriver? Why do you lock that door? Should I ask? I'll just ask. Why do you lock that door? Because we can't afford to lose our shit to the people in the woods. Uh they come down here every once in a while and raid our stuff, even with the fence. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Oh, that was easy. I thought we would have to, like, sneak out and turn on some alarm or something. <gasps> go, 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 go. Wait, I need a screwdriver. I should have asked him for a screwdriver. Where do you think there's a screwdriver? Oh, no, no. I don't have a screwdriver. Do you think there's a screwdriver in here?
Okay, maybe I don't need a screwdriver. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Nah. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. <laughs> Danny needs something again. <sighs> All right. Be right. <laughs> right back, Doc. See you later. <laughs> Can I close the door? No, I don't mean you should. You shouldn't go outside. False alarm. I'm back. What? He's so quick. Okay. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. You got a screwdriver? For what? Uh, uh never mind. <laughs> Alrighty then. How do I get him to go away? I can't make him go away now. Hey guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Oh, sorry. Come on, enough already. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm just looking at it. What do I do? Can you walk away again? Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Alrighty then. <laughs> okay. I. I don't know what to do. That was the barn door. Oh. <laughs> so, how does a woman like yourself run this whole no, place? No, he's flirting. That's why you thought they were nice people. He wants to bone the lady. Okay, you know what, chat? I'm gonna leave it here, though. And we're gonna try next time to open the barn. I think, I think it should be fine. I think it should be saved here. I think this should be okay.